All right, hello everybody. We're finally doing it. Had a couple technical technical difficulties, but all seems well. This is Storm Silver. Been talking about doing this for a bit. Good, I can still this there. No info needed, sir. No info needed at all. So, just to clarify, I'm sure many of you are probably wondering what this is, but this is just basically a difficulty hack of Soul Silver that also features a bunch of uh, a bunch more Pokemon mixed in, like from Hoenn and Sinnoh. Just everything up to Gen 4, just all mixed around, because it's in the game, may as well. But it's been recommended to me, and I wanted to I wanted to replay Soul Silver, so it's probably a good probably a good good one to go with. Yawn, huh? What time is it? Is it late already? Oh, I know I overslept. Sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to Sacred Gold or Storm Silver, a hack with an expansion of features. My name is Professor Oak, but everyone calls me Pokemon Professor. Turn the volume back up now. The title screen was loud. Hang on a second. Ba -ba 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 -ba. There we go. Looking good, looking good, looking good. Before we go any further, I'd like to tell you a few things you should know. Let me show you a native Pokemon. Why, it's Little Meryl! The Johto and Kanto regions were known for having only a fraction of the Pokemon within its borders, but large-scale migration has brought a great variety to the region's fauna. There are new challenges awaiting you, and a great amount of differences in how you'll raise your Pokemon. Now, why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? Be a boy or girl? Won't you please tell me? Well, I picked Rosa last time, so I'm gonna be Ethan. Please tell me your name. Sure, sure, of course. Let's see. Does all all input stuff on the touchscreen. Let's move down around there. Bobbity, bobbity, bobbity. Your name is Asprey. Yes, it is, Mr. Oak. Asprey, are you ready? Your very own tale of grand adventure is about to unfold. Let's go in the world of Pokemon. I'll see you later. If you ever want to find out some of the changes, check the documents you should have come with your game. Most, if not all, information you need should be contained there somewhere. But as you like... Ugh, for you... Yeah, but play as you like it, for you might enjoy playing the unknown. Either way, be sure to have fun. Dre. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. No, it's fine if you didn't give me the docs. Um, you can just go ahead and uh, relay some of the smaller information to me. All I really need to know is that makes the game harder, and there's more Pokemon to choose from. It's a Wii! Wii is huge in Johto, too! Okay, then. I don't have access to options. Let's just go downstairs. Can't even increase the tech speed yet. Hello, Mother. About time you woke up. Professor Elm wanted to see you. Here's your things. Finally. I hear Johto has changed a lot in the last few years. You should be careful. Here, take your running shoes. You'll probably want your bike and music player as well. Obtained a bicycle. Okay. Bicycle in the key items pocket. Game Boy sounds. Right off the, right off the bat, we get in this stuff. I'm sure you know how to use these. Oh, I hear Elm has a gift for you. Uh, uh oh. Hang on a second. I just realized something. Okay, good, good, good. I thought I, uh... Hang on. Thought I had something. I thought I had a certain setting turned on. It's fine. Just making sure. Worthless. Hello, little Meryl. Look at you. Such a cute friend. I forget. Is um Professor Elm like the father of Lyra or Ethan in this game? I don't recall. Are they just the assistant? Probably assistant. All right. Immediately we can run. Now, let me see here. Options. Let's see. Put that to fast. Let's see. Now, everything else is fine. That's all I gotta do. Confirm. Let's talk to good old Silver. So, this is the famous Elm Pokemon Lab. What are you staring at? He just shoves me away. Hmm. Are any of the NPC dialogue throughout the, the towns different? Like, do I need to hunt them down for different stuff? Possibly. I don't know. 
I've been waiting for you to arrive. I've been curious about how Pokemon feel walking outside their Pokeballs. I was hoping I could have your help with the tests. Oh, hey, I got an email. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hey, listen, I know a person named Mr. Pokemon. Mr. John M. Pokemon, who finds all sorts of crazy stuff. He says he has something. But we're so busy with our research. Can you pick it up for us? You can take one of the Pokemon in the machine. Alright, let's see if I can get something good here. Chikorita, Cyndaquil, Tortodile. I don't know which one to pick, actually. Um... Chikorita, Chikorita, Cinda, Chikorita, Cyndaquil, Cyndaquil, Chikorita, Cyndaquil, Chikorita. I see nobody likes Totodile, except that one person. Ah. Uh. Cyndaquil, 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 Cyndaquil. Cyndaquil, Totodile. Chikorita, Chikorita, Cyndaquil, Totodile. There ain't no one gonna be doing this. Okay. Just go Totodile, but Cyndaquil is better. Hmm. You know what? Since I always shit on this thing, why not? So you like Chikorita, the grass-type Pokemon? Like is a strong word, Professor Elm. Oh, that is an ugly ba that is an ugly overworld sprite. <laughs> Give a nickname to Chikorita? Sure. It's a guy. What do I call it? What do I call it? Hmm. Hmm. Well, I've been playing Persona and Code Realize. You know what? How about, since it's a guy, how about I call it... Lupin. How about that? Is Lupin the nickname you want to give it? Sure! How do you like walking with your Pokemon? It's not bad, is it? You can take it all the way to Mr. Pokemon's house. If Pokemon gets hurt, you shield it with this machine. It's so easy to use, just check the PC on my desk. Oh boy. Mr. Pokemon goes everywhere and finds rarities. His house is past Cherry Grove City. Go north a little past Cherry Grove. I'm counting on you. All right. Let's take a look at Little Lupin. What do we got here? Let's see. Calm nature. Well, it doesn't get good attack. Eh. So Razor Leaf and Vine Whip are gonna be ass. Let's see, and Overgrow. I want you to have these to help with your task. Obtain potions, wonderful. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Pokemon are weak in the beginning. Don't hesitate to use a potion if you think yours is in danger. Well, all right then. Looks like the game finally begins. Never mind, I have another NPC I need to talk to. Hey, you got yourself a Pokemon. I gotta say, it's really cute. When you walk with it, it'll become more friendly. But you turn around and talk to it sometimes, too. Well, that's right, why don't you show it to your mom? See ya! Oh boy. Lupin doesn't seem used to its own name yet. Well, you better get used to it. What now? <laughs> Let me play the game. Wait a sec. I really I really am back to Gen 4, aren't I? Did you leave your Poke Gear at home? You should ask your mom. Okay then. Oh, that's a cute Pokemon you have. Professor Elm must have given it to you. Oh, Professor Elm has a task. What kind of task? I see, that sounds a little difficult, but when it, someone makes that kind of request, it must be important. That's right, I completely forgot. Your Poke Gear came back from the repair shop. Here you go. How did it break? Wonder how it broke. Pokemon gear, or Poke Gear as it's often called, is what every trainer should have. Guess what? You can use Poke Gear to make a phone call. Do you remember how? Yes. Just power in the Poke Gear and touch the telephone, okay? Names of people. I said yes, Mom. I believe I said yes. Well, I can't believe it's so easy to make a phone call. All right. So I have access to the bike right away, which is nice. Let's see. Gonna select it. Game Boy sounds. Game Boy sounds are fake Game Boy sounds, though. Okay. 
Oh, what now? Wait one second. This is the third time I've been stopped trying to leave. Come on. Almost completely forgot about this. I did too, Elm. I did too. Here, I'll give you my number. Registered Professor Elm. Every time I play a DS Pokemon game, I go through this song and dance. I'll call if anything comes up. <laughs> give up and go back to bed. Alrighty. So... This is the mock bike. This is... Was this in HeartGold SoulSilver? HeartGold SoulSilver had, um... They, they had a regular bike, didn't they? Am I misremembering? Hello, Bidoof. Take it down, Lupin. It was in Diamond... I know it was in Diamond and Pearl and Platinum. I just wasn't sure if it was HeartGold SoulSilver. Like, Fire Relief Green, I had a standard bike as well for that gen. Come on, Lupin, let's go. I'm playing this game because I'm it's supposed to be difficult, and I wanted to replay Soul Silver with a challenge. So I guess picking Chikorita is probably the best best option here. Let's see. Is volume too loud? I hope not. Let's see. Maybe I should just walk with the little Chikorita. Bum, 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 zigzagoon. Nice. Volume's a, bu a bit much. Okay, turn it down. The, the volume, the, yep, it's sticking out because the battle music, isn't it? Hang on. Turn it down slightly. How's that? I'm gonna get attached to Lupin now, and I'm gonna learn to love Chikorita. Just imagine Chikorita with a, with a little fancy top hat. Because it's because he's a phantom thief. Or gentleman thief, whatever, whichever you want to go for. So I also believe the person who made Storm Silver and Sacred Gold, they also made, uh, what were they called? Blaze Black and Volt White. Those are also challenge hacks of, uh, Black and White, if I'm not mistaken. The random cut tree is gone. Oh, yeah, I think there was, I heard something about them taking out a bunch of unnecessary HM spots for convenience. All right, let's go. Eh, it's a start. Oh, Razor Leaf right away. Too bad my nature is a minus attack. Alright, I'm gonna take this off. Let's just walk with Lupin for now. Hey, how are your Pokemon? If they're weak and not ready for battle, keep out of tall grass. Yeah, it is gone. I can take a shortcut. Do you see those ledges? It's scary to jump off, but you can go to New Bark Town without walking through tall grass. an apricorn tree. Since there's nothing to put it in, there's no reason to take it. Waiting for that Pokemon that only appears at night. I'm gonna be trying to raise a full team as we go through this, because I know that all important trainers, like gym leaders, they got they have a full party. Ah. You're a rookie trainer, right? Let me show you around. Well, this sounds like a good point to take a drink and, uh, mash the button. Let me show you around. It won't take long, I promise. This is a Pokemon Center. They heal your Pokemon. This is a Pokemon Mart. They sell stuff. Alright. Route 30 is out this way. Trainers will be battling their Pokemon. If you go a little further, you see Mr. Pokemon House. Learning. Come on, keep up with me, Sonny Boy. This is the sea, as you can see. Some Pokemon are only found in water. What was that noise? Didn't sound right. This old man goes. And here's my house. As a reward for following me, take this old rod. Oh, okay. That's not bad to get at the start. Simply toss that rod into the water and you'll have a chance of getting a bite. Now I definitely can't get soft locked. What a nice old man. I wonder, does anyone else give me stuff that they normally don't? You're trying to see how good you are as a trainer? You better visit the gyms. When I get older, I'm gonna become a gym leader. Make my Pokemon battle with friends and make them tougher. They don't get experience that way, Weenie. Oh, hi, Andrew. What now? What do you want? Huh, I made it. I forgot one thing, Sonny boy. Here's a token from me. Take it. The guy gent loaded the map card onto my Pokegear. And now show the town map. Yippee! Okay, here becomes more useful. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's 
play this. Found a potion. That's good. That's wonderful. My Chikorita doesn't look like a, look right on the overworld. In a second. Does that guy even give me any? <laughs> hey, kiddo! How in the world can you be so oblivious to my eye-catching house? Come over here now! That's right. Don't you run away from me. When you follow the path up north, you'll see Mr. Pokemon's house. Where you go? Let me finish what I have to say. Do you have any apricorns? Apricorns tree trees bear fruit once a day. I have one of those tr trees now. You really are something. You can make pokeballs and other things. They're quite useful. I have a feeling this is meant to be because I have something for you. Hmm. I forgot that they put like so many people in your way just doing the errand to Mr. Pokemon's house. Was it really this many? Jeez. And there's a fight going on up here. Hey, wait a second. There's a fight. Where's the other trainer? Go, Ratata. Tackle. What, this is a big battle. Leave me alone. Where's the other youngster that's supposed to have the Pidgey? Huh, weird. Weird, weird, weird. Alright. There's a little Caterpie. Go Lupin. Loopy Lupin. Can't razor leaf this, but at least when I see Geodudes or something, this should be good. Um, do I need to turn it down even more? The, the, the battle music in this game is really overpowering. Let's turn it down. Hope it sounds good now. I don't want it to be too loud. Usually no one cares, but I care. I care about you, audience. Uh, hi, Cynthia. Hello, Mr. Pokemon said he was expecting a young trainer to arrive. Is your name Asprey? I see. I guess you are the trainer Mr. Pokemon was expecting. My name is Cynthia. I'm a Pokemon trainer who hails from Sinnoh. Tell me, have you heard a story that tells the tale of the legendary trainer? You haven't. I'll briefly explain. The story tells the tale of how a trainer travels the lands of Johto and Kanto, catching all the Pokemon known to mankind. He captures the most basic of Pokemon and even the most mythical of Pokemon to eventually come face to face with the one who, who, who the Pokemon call God. The archaeology in the Johto region appears to back the existence of this story. It is interesting to be sure. Gotcha. Fill the Pokedex, find Arceus. Thank you for listening to me. You know, you remind me of a trainer I knew from Sinnoh. May not yet know it yet, but I think you are capable of great things. In fact, I'd like to help you reach your maximum potential. Here, let me give you a small gift. Yes, we received an Eevee. All right. I got an Eevee. I got an Eevee. Let's go. Eevee. What do I name this thing? Um, what else have I played? What else else have I been playing lately? Ah, uh, quick! Wh who am I? What video games do I like? E Re Resident Evil Three. That's true. That's true. You know what? I'm gonna name it after Mr. Carlos Oliveira. How about that? I easily forget what video games I play when I'm playing things. No, I'm not gonna name it Dom. I'll say that for something else. The numerous possibilities of evolutions for Eevee make it very interesting. I wonder what you'll decide to evolve Eevee into. Perhaps we'll cross paths again, but until then, farewell. Neat. I got a little Eevee. Gentle nature. So let's see, plus special attack, minus defense. That's that's fine, honestly. I did spell Carlos's last name right, I hope. That is how you say it, uh, uh, Oliveira. Be really bad. I didn't. All right. It's got adaptability there, yep. You must be Asprey. I was I who sent the email to Professor Elm earlier. Let me turn the volume down slightly for myself. All right, what do you got for me, Mr. Pokemon? Is it a good old mystery egg? Let me see that. Adjust things here. How is it? 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 This is what I want Mr. Er, Professor Elm to examine. The mystery egg. I wonder what this thing evolves to. Friend of mine. Evolve it to Flareon. Chikorita and Flareon. Wow, that's like the... That's that's gonna be like my hardest Pokemon video eh, yet. 
friend of mine from Mekriti gave that to me. I bet you can't find this kind of egg in Johto. I thought Professor Ohm might be able to tell what it is. He's the best when it comes to research of evolution. That's a quote from the famous Professor Oak. You are returning to Elm? Here, your Pokemon should have some rest. All right. Hello, Mr. Oak. And with that, I'm Professor Oak, a Pokemon researcher. So you're Asprey. I was just visiting my friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand for Professor Elm, so I waited here. Oh, what's this, a rare Pokemon? I see, you must be helping Elm with his research. I think I understand why Professor Elm gave you that. You will treat your Pokemon with love and care, it seems. That's nice. Ah, you seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? See, this is the latest version of Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. I'd like you to have it. See the Pokedex from Professor Oak. Nice. Go meet many time, kinds of Pokemon to complete that Pokedex, but I've stayed too long. I have to get to Goldenrod for my usual radio show. Asprey, I have a feeling that this is not the last time we'll meet. Let's exchange numbers just to be on the safe side. Whatever you do, just don't call me at random hours. Yeah. I have an important message about the game that I think you missed earlier because chat was moving too fast. Um, feel free to let me know. Go ahead, go ahead and repeat it. Mm. Oh, hello, Asprey? It's a disaster. Every Everything's terrible. What should I do? Oh, no. Please get back here now. All right. All right, let's go, Lupin. Yeah, there's a lot of people in chat today because I'm playing Pokemon. D Suffering from success. I can make that meme. Let's see. Tackle. Where are we at? Oh, jeez, you're right. That's a lot of viewers than what I'm used to. Let's see. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Prone to graphical glitches when entering and exiting maps so it can cause black screens. It happens. Just save and reset. Okay. That's fine. I'll just save to be on the safe side sometimes. Did that Caterpie just use Bide when I wasn't looking? Let's see how much this grows as we go. Yeah, I play a main series Pokemon game and people come a-running. In that case, you may ask, why don't you just play these all every day? The simple answer is, if I played Pokemon every day, I'd be bored of it. That's why I take breaks away from it. Alright. And we're gonna be coming up a... I wonder, what is Silver gonna have? Yeah, heal me up, Joy. Is he gonna... There's no... He's gotta have more than one Pokemon this time if Cynthia gives me an Eevee. I, I know he's gonna have a Cyndaquil. <laughs> Let's see here. Don't have berries. Razor leaf should be fine, but... I'm gonna put Eevee up fine. It doesn't matter if I win or lose this fight, but let's just do it. Here we go. You got a Pokemon at the lab? What a waste. That's where... That's a Pokemon that's too good for a wimp like you. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Here he comes. Versus nobody. Just one. Okay, I was gonna say, if he had two Pokemon, he wouldn't have needed to steal one. Alright, let's get him. Send him with the sand attack. This is still the same so far, obviously. Let me hit him with a Tail Whip, because I'm gonna switch in the Chikorita here. Don't get knocked down, yeah. Don't get knocked down, Oliveira. Let's just call him Carlos, but he pretty much is just Carlos. Keep your head screwed on, Romeo. Get going, get going. I'm still stuck on Nightmare Mode in RE3, by the way. I can't beat Nemesis. 
He's so hard. You have to master perfect dodge in Nightmare and Inferno. I get, I keep getting so close, and then I have to start over, and I just, oh. At least I'm taking comfort knowing that lots of other people are having trouble with it, too. Hm, you're doing okay for someone weak. Same. Oh, I, I'm really tempted to just grind for the stars manual. I might end up doing that when I play it. Call your next Pokemon Nemesis? I could, I could call him Nemesis. That'd be kind of dumb, though. Calling Silver Nemesis might be fun. Stars. Do you know who I am? I'm gonna be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. Oh no. Get that back, that's my trainer card. Oh no, you saw my name. I like how they had to make that scene to clarify that Silver's name isn't just question mark, question mark, question mark. Because as a kid, I thought that's what he was telling me. He said, my name is question mark, question mark, question mark. I thought that's what he was actually saying to me. Not that, like, it was meant to be blank. Anyways, come along, Levy. Oliveira seems to be about to fall over. Well, better give him a green herb. Bum. Bum. Who are you? We're investigating the case of a missing Pokemon. Rule number one, whoever did it will come back to the site. Oh my, you must be the one who did it. Oh, that's some damn fine police work, son. Hold on a second, he has nothing to do with it. I saw it. There was a red-haired boy looking into the building. He's only saying this because I'm wearing my hat backwards. He thinks I'm a radical 90s kid, rough and tough. What, you battled a boy like that? He must be the one who did it. Did you happen to get his name? Uh, chat, this is a dumb question, but how do you spell Nemesis again? I always mess it up. Let's see, was it... Is it M-I? Miss... No, no, it's E, right? It's M-E. Nemesis? Nemesis. 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 There you go. I'm, I got it right. Sometimes I spell this word wrong. And then I look at it too long, and then I'm like, wait a minute, is this even a real word anymore? Yes, there, there are lots of people in chat today. Plenty of people to disappoint and turn away from my streams forever. Plenty of people to come here once, and then when they show and then when they come to a non-Pokemon in the stream, they'll be like, hey, so when's Pokemon, bro? Chat is going fast. I'm not used to this. I'm glad they understand you are innocent. See you later. Thanks for the sub, random person. Asprey, this is terrible. Oh, yes. What was Mr. Pokemon's big discovery? I got a mystery egg, bro. I'm assuming it's not going to be Togepi this time. Huh? This is an egg. This egg may be something I've never seen. Still, it's just an egg. Mr. Pokemon is always fascinated by eggs. Well, since he gave it to us, we might as well find out what its secrets hold. I'll keep it for a while to find out. What? Oak gave you a Pokedex? Is that true? That's incredible! He's superb at seeing the potential of people as trainers. Wow, I knew you were a little different. Things are gonna be fun. Your Pokemon seems to really like you. So why don't you take the Pokemon Gym Challenge? If you manage to defeat all the gym leaders, you'll eventually challenge the League. Or not. <laughs> Becoming the League Champion is not at all easy, but you are certainly... Or you can certainly challenge Violet City's Gym. Mm, challenge in the gym scattered around will be a long journey. Before you leave, make sure to talk to your mom. Oh, I will. Otherwise, she'll bother me later. Here we go. The egg is no longer a groundbreaking discovery anymore. It can never be. So you're leaving on an adventure. Okay, I'll help too. What can I do for you? I know. Every time you receive prize money, I'll save some of it for you. A long journey. Money's important. Do you want me to save your money? I guess... Because she gives certain items doing this. Maybe it's different for this hack. Pokemon are your friends. When you work as a team, you can accomplish anything. Now go. All right. Stay frosty. Let's go. Come along, little Eevee friend. Come to think of it. Oh, no. <laughs> Never mind. Catching tutorial. There you are. You can catch wild Pokemon with Pokeballs. Follow me. No, 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 Lyra. No, I, I know how to do that. Jumping, it was just like that, huh? Was I too fast? I'll try it again. Oh, 
You know, I bet you know how already. I'll give you these. Good luck. Oh, thank you. Thank you, developer. See you. You know how to do it. Just get going. All right, so what do we got here? Oops. How many Pokeballs did I get? We're saved. Now we need to start catching things. Let's try and use as many Pokemon as I can throughout this. 15. We can replace things later on, but let's Pokemon our friends and let's make lots of friends, chat. But I don't want to be friends with this thing, though. Ain't no playthrough. Is it ever worth being friends with, uh, the Rattata? I just realized I didn't heal at the heal at the machine. Let me do that. What happened to the other ones? At the very least, I consider catching Zigzagoon, because pickup. Hmm. I can't imagine what Youngster Joey's gonna have here. Oh, I'm gonna check out the north route, don't worry. Let's just do this. Ah, just getting a drink there. The Rattata would have Hustle. You know what? Fair enough. But it's not... I just don't vibe with it. I'm sorry, but that's just how it goes. Rattata is like... It can be good, but it's like an ugly villager in Animal Crossing. I don't want to talk to it, and I'll hope it leaves. Who's gonna be the Moomin of the group? Well, I already named a Smeargle Moomin. I can't just name someone else Moomin. And it won't be as special. Bum, bum, bum. Hi, Wormpool. Level 5. Oh, no. I used Tail Whip. Moom in the second. Christian, you're so mean. I don't want... I don't want a Rattata, though. What's Wormpool doing here? Well, this is, uh, this is a hack, so things are different. Get him, Oliveira. Give him that melee. Go over there and punch him. Take him down. One Pokemon at a time. One Pokemon at a time. I don't even know what everything is here is here yet. I want to go to the north, see if I can find anything besides, uh, Route 1 trash. Let me skip here. So just a reminder, every Pokemon is in this game. Well, every Pokemon up to the end of Gen 4, obviously. But, um... They're all spread out and scattered across the maps here. Oh! Swablu. That's actually pretty cool to catch early on. I could do that. See if I can get it. I've n I don't think I've ever used Altaria. Get Burb. Now, this is better than a Wormpool chat. Much better. What level does Swablu evolve, though? I don't recall, because I've never used one. Darn. If I was playing Final Fantasy VII, I'd name it Cloud. But I'm not. So I can't name it that. Throw another ball. 30-ish. Gosh dang it. It's not gonna survive another tackle. It's 35? Alright. <sighs> Would Razor Leaf leave it alive? I think so. Wow, this stream really is, uh... Getting a lot of viewers right now. <laughs> anyway, he growled me, so this should be fine. Kind of wasn't expect. I was expecting a little more than usual, because you know it's main. It's it's heart gold, soul silver. But jeez, let's try again. Didn't even bother getting it down the right. I just want to catch it. Nimbus, too easy. Hmm. Should we enable slow? No, it's fine. It's fine. Just let it go. Is 
Its wings bring cottony clouds to, to mind. It's gro it grooms with spring water and loves to sit on heads. Aww. That's so cute. Now what do I name it? What do I name it? It's a girl. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Marshmallow. Bluth. Cottony. <laughs> Winona. You know what? It is her signature Pokemon, and Winona is cute. And underappreciated, so why not? I did just spell it right. Right? It's Winona. Yeah. There we go. Let's take a look at it. I don't want to have to- I don't want to reach catch Pokemon if they have a bad nature or something, too. Docile, that's- okay, that's all equal. Like, I just want to be friends with the Pokemon. And its dex number is 333, so it's 50% evil. Unless I find, a, like, a shiny Swablu, like I did with, uh, during the Black Randomizer, where I- where I caught a Teddy Ursa, and then I ran into a shiny Teddy Ursa. Of course I was going to use the shiny one. <gasps> angry Jigglypuff. Not as angry as Wigglytuff is in Pokemon Conquest. Let's beat it up. Jiggles. Uh-oh. Yeah, let's get out of there. Get in there, Lupin. Jigglypuff, 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 go. Wigglytuff gets a, gets scary and explores. I mean, fair enough. Uh, it's low HP. I could try and catch this for now. Again, I might be swapping out the Pokemon I use throughout this playthrough. Like, I kind of want to mix and match things. I don't want to just stick with the same... Ah, the, sta the same party for the entire game. Because I think it'd be more, be more fun. Just kind of mess with things. Hmm, here we go. Match the A button. It, it increases it. Increases the chances. There we go. Jigglypuff was caught. Jigglypuff's day was added to Pokedex. Balloon. Looking into its cute round eyes causes it to sing a relaxing melody, inducing its enemies to sleep. Now, what do I call this thing? I could just call it Oichi. I don't know if I'm really going to stick with this. Name it what Elon Musk named his child. <laughs> I don't even know if the characters for that are here. You should try a different route sometime. You never know what Pokemon you're going to get. <gasps> Psychic Piggy! But we got to run. Or you know what? I'm going to get Eevee a level up here. Let me let Lupin use Razor Leaf. I love little piggies, but I don't like Grumpig. Grumpig is a hideous looking Pokemon to me. But Spoink is adorable. Uh oh. I just got confused by confusion. Never evolve it then. Tasty, tasty bacon. Snap out of confusion. Razor Leaf, get him. Slice him apart. Oh, there, good level six. He's staying frosty. Okay, 12. I didn't check the stats of my Jiggly. Docile again, soundproof. Yeah, that might come in handy, depending on who the opponent is. Special attack is 10. Okay, let's do what we can. Let's get on up here. And get back to Cherry Grove's Pokemon Center. A little easier to navigate this. 
Definitely gonna be a slow progress game because I'm gonna be checking out all the routes and stuff and try I'm probably gonna need to level up a bit a bit more, definitely. We'll see what the trainer Pokemon is like. I I think I'm also Uh I think I'm also aware of the fact that the AI in this game, it doesn't waste turns by just randomly picking Growl or something. Like, it'll actually try to attack you. So I have to be prepared for that as well. I should be making more saves, just in case something goes wrong. Saving a lot of data. Always a lot of data. Dang, it's really been 40 minutes. 40 minutes and I'm only just really starting. That route can also have Shinx. Hmm. I like Shinx. I really like Shinx. And I especially like the fact this has different movesets, so Luxray might actually be usable. Let me go back and check. Let's run, little Eevee, run. Oliveira looks like he wants it wants to lead. Oh, yes, he can. There's lots of Pokemon available at the start, and there's gonna be tough trainers ahead. I gotta take advantage. Numel. I can't really razor leaf it, but let me see how much damage I do. I don't wanna catch Numel. Yeah, definitely a good thing I didn't switch to Chikorita there. Take it down. Luxray sucks, I know, but in this game, the move sets have been adjusted to make Pokemon better. Apparently, some Pokemon have had their typing adjusted as well. I have no idea what that what that means. Just a good old Geodude here. I may as well just switch to Chikorita for some easy experience. Razor Leaf. Razor Leaf. This will get me my level up. Which I'm definitely gonna need. Lux Ray's Electric Dark in this one. Okay. Kinda wanna get it. His Lux Ray is cool. But in every game, they official game he's in, he's so bad. Like, I had a shiny Lux Ray once. Hmm. Maybe it's a dragon poison you, dude. Who knows? Nah. I'm grinding now while watching the stream. Well, that's what the stream is here for. For you to put on in the background. And escape your life. Yeah, let's just get out of here. I want to see what else I can find here as well. For some reason, I'm finding a bunch of Geodude and Numel now. Hmm. Get going. Spiro. Spiro. That's what's normally here. I don't want Spiro. No Shinx. Ugh. May as well just take this thing out. If I'm if I'm going through wild encounters, I may as well get something. It's good this Eevee has adaptability, though. I have no idea what I'm gonna go for for an evolution, though. Um... Quick question. Does HeartGold Soul Silver have a location for Leafeon and Glaceon? I don't think I've ever thought of that until now. Maybe Espeon or Umbreon. I kind of like Espeon. Houndour and Shinx are nighttime encounters. All right, you just saved me some time, chat member, because you're probably that. That's probably right. They don't have Moss or Ice Rock. Mm. That makes sense. I, I completely forgot nighttime encounters were a thing. They're probably like one of my favorite things about original Gen 2. It really blew my mind back in the day. Flareon. 
Well, I got some level up, so it's all good. Uh, let me put the Swablu up front now. In the original game, there's no ice or moss, so you just had to trade with Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum to get it, basically. Is that how they did it? Hang on, what moves does Winona have? Pluck. That's a... That's decent to have. It starts. You can use that against the bugs there. Yeah, you had to trade with Sinnoh. Uh, it's like Umbreon and Espeon in Fire and Leaf Green. There was no time mechanic, so you literally couldn't even evolve them into Umbreon or Espeon. You either had to get them from Colosseum or from uh, Ruby and Sapphire Emerald. But then there's Sentret. I was hoping to find a bug. Got away safely. They give you evolution items for all the evolutions. Makes sense. Am I gonna change my computer time for Shinx and Hound Hour? Eh, don't really need to change. I don't know if I'll do that. I might do that on my own. Maybe I can do an evening stream on Sunday just to mix up the encounters. We'll see how it goes. Anyways, first let's heal. I don't need- I don't need for it for the walk. Bop, 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 bop. Alright. I should see what the shop is selling. Let's see. Don't recall this music being in this game. Maybe I should buy a couple more Pokeballs in case I lose. Let me buy ten more. Premier Ball, right. And some potions for the field. Antidote in case I get poison somewhere. Alright. Assuming I'm not going to end up... Or assuming there's no items from the NPCs to just kind of pick up here. I certainly hope not. Single encounter, go. Let's see what we got. What do we got? What do we got? Low tad. Well, I can use Pluck on this. Take it down. Since people are mentioning shiny Pokemon again, um... I'm assuming the shiny odds in this game aren't adjusted. They're still 1 in 8,000 something. Unless you do whatever method. Not that I'm gonna be grinding for shinies, don't worry. See, I don't really care about the Apricorns. Pokemon use Moon Lugs, yes, the PP. And you should take a Pokemon to BC. Let's see what I can find right here. Kuna. I can also use Pluck on this. That'd be good. That'd be good. Get it, Winona. Get over there and peck it. Or pluck it. Kick it. Whatever. Hopefully Kakuna will give me a little bit of extra experience, I hope. Let's just fight Joey. I just lost, so I'm trying to find more Pokemon. Wait, you look weak. Come on, let's battle. Alright, he's bringing the battle. Let's go. There we go. Youngster Joey, he's got one. The only. The big rat. Big rat. Hang on a second. Adjust this slightly. Ah, whatever. It's fine as it is. Okay. I'm just gonna send in Lupin and Razor Leaf it. Let's not get knocked down. Tackle. He's got stabbed from that. Focus energy. Wow. He's using the top percentage moves. Ugh. I just lost. Prepare to lose. The youngster Joey Motto. Quick attack. 
Okay, okay. He's not being dumb. What's Youngster Joey's normal level here? It's like three or four, isn't it? Winona Green level five. Nice. Astonish. Eh, maybe we could have some utility somewhere. Oh, by the way, evolutions are also adjusted in this game, so you don't need to trade to get anything. Send some to mom. Oh, good mom. Hey, can I get your number? I'm gonna regret this. Why not? Press your phone number. I'll ring you whenever I get the urge to battle. All right. I'm glad people seem to at least be enjoying this. Um, originally the plan was to wait till I finish Minish Cap or uh, Duel Academy, but there's still definitely a couple more sessions of those games I'm gonna require. And I was at a point where I don't like streaming the same thing every single day. I gotta mix it up a bit, so I figured, why not? This sounds like a lot of- f this seemed like a lot of fun when this was described to me, and I really wanted to play my main Pokemon game again. Hmm. Take it down. I don't think I've ever actually used Crobat in a main play- in a, in a real playthrough. What's happening here? You look like a new trainer. Let me show you a lesson in flower power. This trainer is definitely not normally here. Aroma Lady Julia. But do well at least I have an option for this. Come on now, come on. She's ready to go. Hopefully I don't get poisoned or something. Growth. Pluck. Seven. Ow. Sentrit. You know what? You send it out, and I'm gonna switch in. Go, loop, and go. Go, loop, and go. Foresight. Let's take it down. Let's take it down. How do I get berries in this game again? Since all the berry trees are replaced with the apricorns. Is it? Is it apricorns or apricots? I don't even remember. What did he just hit me with? He did a bit of damage, huh? Went on to game 36. What do you got for me? What do you got for me? Uh, zero and one. I really won't see, be seeing much of a reward off of this uh, Swablu until it evolves, huh? Ooh, Poison Powder. I could make good use of that. C-Dot. Hmm. I should be able to just pluck this just fine. Oh, right, your follower can find them. Go, C-Dot, go. Pluck it. I have Astonish to deal with, uh, ghost types if I- if they show up, or psychic types. This girl's running the whole unnatural selection of Pokemon here. Let me just fix my seat. Cherubi. I forget this Pokemon exists all the time. Very least, this turned out to be a good- uh, Good little experience farm for my for Winona. Take it down. Rip those berries apart. There's the berries. Eat them. I forget you exist sometimes. That's a lie. You're here every stream, Akane. Ah, I am bedazzled. Excellent. Grass Pokemon specialize in disabling their foes. You should raise some. Trainer tips. No stealing other Pokemon. Pokeballs will be thrown only at wild Pokemon. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Is that a battle girl? What's she doing here? Hang on. Maybe I should use a potion. I got nine of them. I did just buy some after all. I'm not a trainer, but if you look one in the eyes, prepare to battle. All right. You're definitely one. Hey, I just met you, and this is crazy, but let's have a battle. I'll win, maybe. <laughs> you can tell this one... This hack isn't very recent. Jigglypoof. 
Wait a second, I just realized something. I just realized something. Did this game- did this put... Normal. Okay, it didn't put fairy type in the game. Um, I'm gonna send out Oliveira for this one. Dated. Absolutely dated. Oh. Maybe that soundproof wouldn't be so bad right now. In fact, I think I will do that. I'm supposed to talk- I should need to talk to someone in the Pokemon Center for something. This was made long before Gen 6. Fair enough, fair enough. Let me run back to the Pokemon Center after this then, if I miss something. I wasn't sure if additional Pokemon have been like, or additional NPCs have been put in place for the towns. There's a fairy type patch by some other person. Oh, okay, that's cool. Uh, I don't want Oichi to go down. I'm really splitting the experience for this one, but screw it, just go for it. Aha! Come on. Give it the pound puff. Maybe Winona can finish it off. There we go. Come on. 48. Level 7. How about a single point to my attack? How about that? Nice. It's at 10 now. Skitty. I know that thing. Uh, do boy, do I know this thing. Skitty. I'm actually running low on PP for this move. Foresight. Why are you wasting time using Foresight? I thought they were supposed to be smarter. Clearly not. M is here. Lowering my defense. I know what you're up to. You ain't gonna get me. Oh. Now I'm faster. Huh. And a whole lot. Clefairy. Ah. You know what? Send it out. I'm gonna switch in and use Razor Leaf. Pound. Critical hit. Okay. I don't think I need to use... I don't think I need to use Poison Powder on this. It would be nice if it did go down. Mm, God damn it. One second here. Uh, every time I look over at this thing, I feel like the volume meters are out of whack. You can never tell. Idle Carly defeated. I lost so bad. Yes, you did. Get out of here. I hope to get into a career of singing. Do you think I'm a good singer? Maybe. Okay, let's see what's at the Pokemon Center. There's what happened to the other youngster that was here. I may as well pick this up. Green Apricorn. Yay! It's great. I can store any number of Pokemon, and it's all free. Communication center upstairs is just built. Trade Pokemon there already. The PC is free for... Uh, this is literally all the same stuff. How about you? Hello there. I'll explain to you about the trainer card. Trainer card, um... Are, I, 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 Y'all sure? Good night. Come on. Get me out of there. Well, I guess I'll heal and keep going forward, then. Violet City. Violet City. Why did I see people saying, go back, then? I was on my way to Violet City. I guess nothing's new in Cherry Grove, then.
Mm. Weedle. Block him. I don't know what I can get with this. Went on to 29. Streamer hears what he wants. Yeah, just like chat members read whatever rules they want and ignore them as they please, it seems. Otherwise, we wouldn't be in this situation, would we? Let's see what this gives me. Landed a Pokemon. Goldeen! Ew. Well, at least I can Razor Leaf it. Get out of there. Fire's power is weakened. Razor Leaf it! Razor Leaf it. At least this will probably give me more than a magic heart. Ouch. Well, if you if you're on the Twitch page, if you scroll down, there should be a big tab that says rules. I made I made a custom graphic for it and everything. No one, but apparently that was a waste of time. Sometimes, as I see. Ah, Let's see what else I can get here. I, I like Gyarados, but. The thing is, you can just get Gyarados at the start of, like, every Pokemon game, can't you? Let me try again. Land the Pokemon. Give me stuff. The screen down there just goes white. It's kind of weird. Polly! That Poliwag's eyes don't look okay. Hmm... Poliwag is something you can already get. Fair, you can already get Poliwag early in Crystal version, anyway. Not Gold and Silver. It's like nighttime. Poliwag appears on this route in the grass. Just go for it. Just take it down. Pluck. Too bad it can't be part fighting type for an easy victory. Ouch. Eight. Extra level ups are always good. They help us. Oh, Seedot. I already have a grass type, though, and Shiftery is actually ass. Shif Shiftery is a Pokemon whose design has grown on me throughout the years, but I just... Shiftery just seems so like such a bad Pokemon to me. It's this weird, like, Tengu puppet thing, but it's it's so bad. Wish they'd do something cool with Shiftry. Too many weaknesses, too. Yeah, if Bug crawls on it, it dies. Kuna. Apparently having uh, Winona up front here is a good idea. Has one of the best abilities in the game. What, what's Shiftry's ability again? I don't recall. Great moves, but bad stats. Chlorophyll. Ah, that move. You think that a Pokemon like that would have, with a design like that, it wouldn't have such a such a standard grass type ability, though. Like it's it's like it's like an evil corrupted puppet. You think they give it like a sign a really cool signature ability? Dark Cave. Pokemon can light it up and explore it. Let's take a look in here. Dark Cave. Oh yeah. Nasty plot and sword stance. There's a Zubat. As my, even though I said I didn't have, I never really used Crobat. Oh, oh, it starts wing attack, huh? It's not really something we need to use because it's Zubat. It's at the start of every Pokemon game. You can get Crobat in any game except um, Fire and Leaf Green because no. At least the Geodude is pretty good for uh, hitting with Razor Leaf. Hmm. 
Rock polish. That ain't gonna help you, son. That ain't gonna help you. There's gotta be more than Geodude and Zubat in here. But taking the, just being a little patient and taking the time to level up a little too isn't bad. Because the gym leader is going to have six Pokemon. They're going to have a full team. I gotta be ready to do stuff. Slugma's here. Slugma's kind of ass, but I've spent, like, my entire YouTube career complaining about how Slugma is only available at, like, Encanto for some reason. Oh, Bronzer. That's, that's interesting. I can't even really damage this thing, though. Let's run away. Having a fire type is good, because one th a problem that Gen 2 has is that if you don't start with Cyndaquil, you don't have a fire type. Ever. Like, the only way you're getting a fire type is if you're playing American Crystal, which gives you the odd egg, and you happen to get a Magby. Because the only Gen 2 fire types, they put them. Oh, look, Dunsparce. Too bad it, it's Dunsparce, and I don't like it. Hmm. Flareon. Does Flareon count as a real fire Pokemon? Some would very much argue it doesn't, with what its move is. Catch it. Catch it. Name it after me. Oh, it yawned. You know, I could have that, maybe. Let me poison it. I'll try Pokeballs. Growlithe and Vulpix are beyond Goldenrod. You know what? Fair enough. I forgot about them. I forgot about them. You got me. Fair enough. I don't know what I'm talking about. Let's see now. Flareon actually gets good stats in this game. Maybe I should use it. Um, let me send out Olivera here. Yes, I think you. I'm. I'm sorry. I'm cor incorrect. It's. It was. It was Diamond and Pearl, where Fire types were the bigger issue. I think I just have a jumbled, jumbled mess of a mind at the moment. I've ranted about this nonstop. The, Gen 4 does not give you very many fire types to the point where Flint doesn't even have any. They had to give him a starter and Rapidash and three non-fire types. Oh, I don't know how they messed that up. Anyways, time to catch. I'll save the Premier Ball for something cool. Alrighty. Let's go, let's go, let's go. When Diamond and Pearl does get remade, I expect Flint to have... They better do something cool with Flint. He got... Flint is prob is arguably the most, like, neglected Elite Four member in the history of Pokemon. If Spotted escapes by burrowing its tail. Alright, I'll name it after you. Hmm. I, I appreciate when people say my playthroughs are helping them through tough times. But I'm just I'm, I'm just playing a video game. I don't feel like I'm doing anything. What happened there? I thought something happened that's on the tile right before I the encounter started. Probably just because of the darkness I got confused. Yeah, Cynthia gave me an Eevee. You can tell it's a fan game because they gave you an Eevee at the start. Gentle nature. Party. Right, it's poison. Oh, right, it's poisoned. That's what that effect was. I triggered the poison the same tile that the encounter happened. Hmm. Yeah, that's what that is. Let's see what else I can find. Like the uh, Slugma here. Yeah, the lead Pokemon doesn't get um, a Pokeball animation. It's because it's walking behind me. May as well take advantage of the fact that there's high level Geo high level Geodude here. Maybe I should head towards Violet City first after this one. Let me just let Chikorita wake up. Again, we're gonna play slow and patient. We're just here to enjoy the game and have fun. Enjoying the game and having fun is fun. Hot take here. It, it seems every time I play a DS Pokemon game, though, I can never 
Look, whenever I look at the audio meter, it always looks like it's way too high. So I'll just check again. Is the volume too loud for people? I'm hoping it's not, because I set it down lower than usual, and it looks like it's overpowering my voice on the thing. It's good? Good. Because I don't want to go through, record for three hours, and then upload a, a, something where people can't even hear me. Volume's good. Fine. It's perfect. All right, good. Good. All right. Christian, Absol isn't available until Route 48, so if you catch a Vulpix, you can name that one after me. Okay, sure. Audio mixing is a mess on DS. Is that just a thing? There's a 4% chance of Larvitar. Fair enough. I don't know if I particularly want to go Tyranitar, though. Huh? Eh? I walked too far today looking for Pokemon. My feet hurt and I'm sleepy. If I were a wild Pokemon, it'd be easy to catch. I'm gonna run to the Pokemon Center up top there. I'll go back to check out some other areas. Don't worry. We're gonna be exploring everything while I can. But, uh, hold up a sec. Let me make a save in case something goes wrong. Save the game. I wonder if I can take down Faulkner at least today. I wonder where I even get the Evolution Stones. I'm assuming they may get much easier to get in this hack. What about you? Found a good Pokemon in Dark Cave. I'm going to raise it to take on Faulkner. He's the leader of Violet City's gym. Goldenrod Department Store. Sounds good. I knew it was you. How did you get past me? Here's something neat for surprising me. Versus Recorder. Yay! Let's see now. I have to go now. I don't I don't need to know the levels of every, every, everything or what Pokemon's going to appear. Just... I, I'm just making a general thing, and I want to fight him. Anyways, let me see what's in the Pokemon Center that people... I forgot they made that really revamped the visual look of these places. Let's see, is it you? It was about three years ago, a group of those called Team Rocket were involved in wrongdoing. They were abusing Pokemon, but bad things never last. The boy did a wonderful job, and Team Rocket disbanded. Why, hello there, trainer. Would you like to take a quiz? Sure. Excellent, let's get started. Question one! Were any Hoenn Pokemon obtainable within Fire Red and Leaf Green? No. Wait, I'm sorry, but that's wrong. Please come try again. Wait, what? Which one? Hang on, what am I missing, chat? Didn't the Sebi Islands only have Johto Pokemon? Deoxys? Oh, that's a reach. Deoxys is a total reach, because they never freaking let anyone have the dang thing. Okay, several Evos, fair enough, whatever. Is Dragonair more than 30 feet long? Dude, I don't know. <laughs> Send me final question. Is it true that Bulbasaur was the first Pokemon created? I know that's not true. It was like Rhydon or something. Final question. Can Tropius found, be found within Diamond and Pearl? I don't know. Alright, there we go. Congratulations, you can now pick a prize Pokemon. Bulbasaur, Charmander, Squirtle, okay. I get a free starter? Sweet. Um, which one do I pick? Hmm. I already have Chikorita, so I don't need Bulbasaur. All grass. Nah. Uh, I'd say Charmander's a good option, too. As you wish. Hey, yeah. I love Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur is one of my favorite Pokemon. It's so cute. Now, what do I name Charmander? It's a guy. Hmm. Let's see. Chikorita's named Lupin. What do I name? Now, what do I name Charmander? You stink. Oh, I'm sorry. He didn't pick Pokemon I wanted. Call it overrated. Now there's a now there's a chat message that's gonna get ten likes and a hundred hundred replies. Smoky. Sir Flame. I kinda dig that, actually. Bubbles. Leon. 
Name Chewy. Call it Leon. You know what? I kind of like the name Leon. I was immediately thinking of uh, Leon from Resident Evil, but I realized people were saying because uh, Sword and Shield. Well, sure, why not? I like the name Leon. Call it Squirtle. Woohoo, look out for more of us quiz masters. Now let's check to see if it's shiny. Oh, level 10. Nice. Adamant nature. Um, I, I, I guess that's fine. It's not the- that, that's fine. Plus attack, minus special attack, whatever. It's, it's Charmander. It's good special attack regardless. Flare Blitz will also be pretty sick, I guess. Yeah, I'm gonna fire type's pretty good. I'll have it. Great, actually. That's right, physical special split. I've been playing too many GBA games. <laughs> I forgot, almost forgot that was a thing. Now let's actually heal. I think I'm gonna deposit the Jigglypuff, though. Because I'm not going to use it. Oh, I forgot how ass the PC kind of was for this one. Um, I guess I'll keep Dunsparce. It has the level to be a switch-in tank, but I'm not going to be keeping that around. Let's see. Make a save in case something goes wrong. Oh, boy. Dunsparce can be kept around for now. No, it just blocks the sparse. Says the person I named it after. Who begged me to name it after them. Alright. <clears throat> Pardon me. Now, before I move back to that other area to fight trainers, uh, let me see what happens if I, um... Can I use the old run on this thing? Man, I really forgot how they visually kind of ramped up areas like Violet City in the remake. I, I haven't played Heart Gold Soul Silver since, like... The really early, the really early 2010s. It's been hasn't been quite a decade, but maybe close to. Which is weird, cause Gen 2 is like original Gen 2 is probably one of my favorites. Now I did like the remake, but I don't know. I just kinda, I don't know if I liked it that much when it came out. Let's see, the, see like an old rod here. What even is worth old rodding at this point? I'm assuming I wait what. Come on, give me that. I guess I had to move one step over for this side. Alright. So we'll see if I can grab something. Fishing. Not even a nibble. I mean, I get. Oh, yeah, I can register a second item. Doesn't it. Yeah, that's the touchscreen register, though. It's not a big deal. It's not a big deal at all. Okay. If I if I give up now, the fish win. The fish win. I'm not letting the fish win. The fish can't win. It must. Come on. Come on. Why, why isn't there a fish here? Like, you need to just move a space now? Come on. Come on. Not even a nibble. There has to be fish here. There has to be. Why? <laughs> no. I, I, no. I, I, they can't win. I'm gonna fish it up. There's a shiny Pokemon here. Just watch. Not even a sea bass. Not even a Magikarp. Nothing. I think Violet has no water encounters. It wasn't that way in the original, but that's weird. I guess so. Isn't there a message that just says like it looks like there's nothing here or something? Yell at the fish. I don't need to go in. I don't need to go inside of um. Sprout Tower normally just has Rattata and sometime and uh, Ghastly at night. Hang on, I should see if the in-game trades are different. If you fish there a hundred times, you get a shiny Mew. She uses the names of all the food she really enjoys eating. For the nickname she gives her Pokemon, I mean. I call my Pidgey Strawberry. Pidgey. That's acceptable, I'll take it. 
Chat, when it comes to naming things in Pokemon, I think everybody should be allowed to do what they want. But if you name your player character Ash, as far as I'm concerned, you've you've revoked your your right to breathe. I collect Pokemon. Do you have Rhyhorn? Want to trade it for Gligar? Interesting. Gliscor is a thing. Pokemon you get in trade grows quickly. You don't have to write badge. They disobey you. Chat, there is nothing more strangely infuriating to me than seeing someone pl play like Sun and Moon, but they name their character Ash. It's like, no, no, that's... That is worse than calling Link Zelda. Worse than calling Samus Metroid. Yo, haven't you had trouble with that boulder block in your way? Of course you have. People like you, here's an HM, come to your rescue. Ugh. What about people who are named Ashley or something? They just pick the girl trainer and name themselves Ashley. No, they pick the girl trainer and name themselves Misty. Canes make them faint rock smash. You can make them use smash boulders once you're in the Violet City Gym Badge. Beware, hidden moves like this are hard for your Pokemon to forget. You should think carefully. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. An odd tree is blocking the way to Ecruteak. It's preventing me from shopping. Something to be done about it. This route, really, if it wasn't for Sudowoodo, Violet City, Goldenrod City, and Ecruteak are so close, they may as well be the same city, if you ask me. Ugh. Oh. Can I get to uh, any grass down here? Yellow apricorn. Y-L-W apricorn. Ah, grass. Here we go. Let's see what we got. Route 32. One thing I kind of like that this game did is that it continued numbering the routes after they ended. And, oh, Pachirisu. Okay. Continue numbering the routes after Kanto. But then in Gen 3, they went- they started with Route 101, and then for Gen 4, they started with Route 201. Uh, I'm gonna go Oliveira here. And then for every game after that, they're like, no, you know what? Route 1 again. Deal with it. And I'm like, oh great, now everything's confusing. I wish they- I think they should have just, um, from the start, they should have given every- every route its own, like, uh, specific name. Like they did with the Sevi Islands. Like, oh, like, oh, critical hit, cool. Like, oh, this is Kindle Road, or this is Bond Bridge. And instead, it's like, here's Route 1, here's Route 2, 3, 4. Oh, you gotta go to 6 first, then you go to 5. We're mixing it up. I always... I always kind of hated how they the routes were, were just boring numbers like that. And I think, uh, wow, I really did nothing to it. Poison powder it. Poison powder it. Take it down. It makes sense for gens 1 to 4 since they're all based in Japan. Fair enough. It's using Bide. The others are just entirely different landmasses. So, yes, I guess it's fair enough. It's just... I wish they would have changed it. Let's see... Wonder if I should just try and catch this thing now. Ah, uh, Pachirisu could actually be decent against, um... Could actually be decent against, uh, flying types. Maybe I should take this thing. And then ditch it. Storing energy. Hmm. Hit with single scratch. But it failed. Hurt by poison. Okay, now let's try throwing Pokeballs at it. This should be helpful. Pachirisu is so cute! Data was added to Pokedex. Electric Ella Squirrel Pokemon. It's one of the kinds of Pokemon with electric cheek pouches. It shoots charges from its tail. All right, we got a Pika Squirrel. Pika Squirrel. Can I even fit that? I'm just gonna name it that. Pika. Uh, how, quick, how do I spell Squirrel? I can't do basic spelling under pressure. Where's the Q? Oh, there it is. 
and uh, you, I, R, R, oh, no, definitely not good in that. Pika is, is Squirrel. Good enough. Not enough characters. Pika Squirrel. Naive nature. Volt Absorb. Eh, not bad, not bad at all, actually. Doesn't have an electro type move, though. What's the dealio with that? But now I need to go heal. What else can I find here? Hopip. Hopip. Ew! It's Hopip. Pluck it. Pluck it, bro. Hopip is such a useless grass-type Pokemon. It just exists early Johto to remind you that Chikorita actually wasn't the worst thing you could have chosen. Ah, great. Now it's healing. I don't want to catch it. Hopip floats away. It does nothing. Nothing. Goodbye. All right, time to heal. That's right. Just, just go ahead and faint. Make the world wiggly. Wiggly world. That guy on the right. If I try talking to him, hello. Should be a familiar face to every Pokemon fan from the TV show, the Show Me Show. I'm Primo, the Big Brother. Would you like one of my? Or would you one of my fans tell me what you think of me? Sure. Oh no, actually, I'm 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 good. Actually, I don't care. Tell you. You cannot possibly mean that you are not interested in the big brother. Oh, that cannot be true. You are just busy, aren't you? That must be it. Why don't you answer my question when you got time? See you. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that guy. Pokemon are really smart. Er, smart. Traded Pokemon might not listen to you right away. For example, high-level Pokemon sometimes refuse to obey. We don't have enough badges. Hmm, can you tell me what kind of trainer you like best? What kind of trainer would you like to be? S psychic. A psychic is the kind of trainer you want to be. Sure. See, so a psychic is the kind of trainer you like. If that's the case, others may come to see you the same way. Talk to me again if you want to let me know what kind of trainer you like best. Hey, you're a trainer, right? Regardless of whether you're a rookie or not, please take this. Oh! Experience share. But held by a Pokemon will give it up. That's actually kind of useful here. Let me put that on somebody. Who am I using right now? I need Pika Squirrel to get Spark. So let me give that to him, because he only has quick attack. Hmm, I might just end up boxing Dunsparce if I get something else. I don't really need to go catch a Slugma, but... Of course my Mons are weak right now, I'm trying to raise six of them. Let's just go check out Sprout Tower now. Definitely don't want to go, de definitely don't want to do the gym right now. Sprout Tower. Bell Sprout over 100 feet tall. People say it became the middle pillar here. See the pillar shaking? People are training upstairs. Sprout Tower was built long ago as a place for Pokemon training. Only those who reach the top will receive a wonderful move. However hard we battle, the tower will stand strong. Sage Nico, Sunkern. Oh wow, they could they, they actually have something worse than Bell Sprout. I do have a Charmander, but I also have this thing. Charmander can uh, do deal damage to other stuff too. I think Charmander will be fine. Let's see now. 
can't rely on Chikorita for Faulkner here. I really, I, I'm actually digging raising this Swablu though. Ralts, oh, okay then. I have Astonish. Let's make use of that. Let's see. Super effective. Ugh, my arm is kind of itchy right now. It's kind of itchy where you just can't scratch it just right. Oh boy. Are they going to have Stantler? We'll see about that. Oh. Come on. You can do it. It's okay. Take your time, Rocky. Level 9 hype. Please? Alright, that's fine. Sing. Eh, the, the accuracy is not good enough to rely on that. Now here comes Bellsprout. I got growled a lot, so let's let um, Leon take care of this one. Still gotta, I still need to let um, Olivera do something. So if I already have a Charmander now, getting Flareon probably isn't something I want to go with. Don't need Flareon and Charizard. Hmm. I'm maybe Espeon. I don't know. I, I like Espeon, both Umbreon and Espeon, but Umbreon's kind of too slow sometimes for when when you use him because he's meant to be tanky. Uh, let's send Winona back in now that refreshed. Hmm. I don't mean slow as just in the, the speed stat. I also mean slow as in what is damp like taking the opponent down with its damage output. I'd rather just- I kind of like the idea of just having Espeon just Psychic sweep everything instead. Take him down. Take a squirrel. I fought hard, but I'm too weak. Yes, you are, mister. Flexible pillar protects the tower, even from earthquakes. Hang on, I should use a potion on... Yeah, there we go. Wait, se wait a second. Why do you have an item? Mm, wait a second. No, no, it has the EXP share, dumbass. How'd I forget that? For some reason, my brain was like, wait, did this thing have pick up? Then I remembered, no, it has Volt Absorb. And I just gave it exp experience share. I don't know why I, I thought that. 300? Oh, we, pa well, we passed another milestone for viewers. So many people to disappoint. Oh, I'm hearing sirens going by outside. We stand guard in this tower. Here we express our gratitude to show our respect for all Pokemon. And respect to all new chat members. Hello, everybody. Sage Chow sent out Bellsprout. We know to get him. Okay, once we get start getting to the higher level stuff up top, Charmander's gonna be helpful there. Hmm. Growth. All is fine. Flareon is a huggable Pokemon. I like Flareon. I actually have a Flareon wallet. Very cute looking one. Execute. I should be fine to still hit that. Don't have bug type moves. Oh, color palette looks kind of weird on Execute. It's kind of like high contrast for some reason. Yeah, reflect. Uproar. Take it down. Take it down. Ah, he's not down. Uproar. Execute is making an uproar. Just smash the button. And this is why I should... Next time I see an Execute, we're sending out... We're sending out Ember Boy. Poliwag. That's a Pokemon. Um... And... You know what? I've been neglecting Olivera here. He's need to get some tackle in. 
Luckily, adaptability plus stab makes tackle a pretty hard hit and tackle. Let's go. Let's go. Don't you use hypnosis, boy. Hit it. No. Faster. Hit harder, bro. Polywag does not look okay. It has a face. A face, all right. Ouch. Thirteen. Let's see. Spark. There we go. Let's see. We don't need... I'm never going to use Bide. Ever. It's just... It's just a move that exists, and we never see, and we never need it. Let's see. Go. All good. Thank you. Thank you for what? Beating up your pets? All living beings coexist through cooperation. We must always be thankful for this. All right. Let's see now. I don't need to keep this on you anymore. Oh, no. Maybe I should just give it to Oliveira now, since... Yeah. Go ahead. Um... X accuracy. Another move. Another thing I'm never going to use. Here he comes. Walk on over. I sway like leaves in the wind. You're also gonna get crunched like we leaves in the wind. Sage Edmund. Marie. I definitely can't take this thing down with this. Hmm. I'll just let Lupin Razor Leaf it. Cause I can... Hmm. Cute sheep. Thunder Shook. Let's hope I can get a critical hit with this. Speed things up a little bit. Oh boy, that did not speed it up at all. And neither did that. I'm gonna have to poison him. There we go. Here it comes. Charging up. I've already divided up the experience enough now. <clears throat> I don't need to switch into Pachirisu. It's fine. Yes, yes, yes. Stop using the charge move. Slash. Take it down already. There's that crit, just when I don't need it. Level 8. It's some Bite! That is... I will take that. I will take that right now. Uh, definitely not gonna be using Helping Hand. Hoot hoot. There's a hoot coming. Let's just use Pika Squirrel. Oh, it's a little Pika friend. It's cute. Spark it. up this battle, so let's just let- let's let Leon burn the Oddish. There's supposed to be wild encounters in this place. Is, is there still wild encounters in the remake? I'm not even sure. Because I'm assuming they put more than Rattata here and Ghastly at night. Yeah, you can find Ghastly at nighttime in the original. 
Can't believe you survived two embers. Burn. Big number. Oh, I'm weak. Yes, you are. Now, get out of my way. I tried to copy Bellsprout's gentle movements for battle, but I didn't train well enough. Why are these people just obsessed with Bellsprout? Potion. They could have at least been obsessed with Victory Bell or something. At least they'd have a little more respect. Let's see. They're a cult. The Cult of Sprout. Just need a potion here. Let's get through them. I train to find enlightenment in my Pokemon. Can I even get by the do get by it all up front? I think I can. Sage Jin. Just a single bell sprout at level 12. Running out of plucks here. I'm, a, I'm all out of plucks to give. That's right. Use growth. Waste your turn. See if I care. Little fluffy cloud's gonna take you out. Oh, dang, not even that much. Level 9. Sweet. This little squirt made me, made me hurt. Wow. Monks don't talk like that. This Pokemon grows stronger, so does the trainer. No, wait. This trainer grows stronger, so do the Pokemon. Same thing, you genius. The Elder's TM lights even pitch black darkness. Dick down. Sage, Neil, and Psyduck. Just like that, I'm gonna have to resort to Chikorita again. You're doing this for Flash? No, I'm doing this for experience. No one ever actually does Sprout Tower for it to get Flash. They do it because there's trainers there. Rip them apart. Oh, what's he doing? What are you doing? Oh. He's smart. He knew what I was up to. The remakes require you to go through Sprout Tower to do the gym. I didn't remember that at all. Hit it with poison powder, I guess. Air cutter, uh-oh. It's not to, though, right? It's not to! He got a crit. Okay. I got bite. Let me just use bite. Oh, he had to use the one air cutter. Hope that would do a little more. Guess not. All right, pick a squirrel. Work your magic. Finish it off. Finish it. Finish it off, you little fluffy friend. All right, here we go. Psyduck again. Ah, uh, just send it out. I gotta have to finish it with the squirrel. Get down. Oliveira grew to level 10. 93. Bulbasaur. He's got a Bulbasaur. Look at this, Look at this mad lad. Uh, Winona should be able to finish it just fine on her own. Bulby sore. It's so cute! I wanna pat its head! Ouch. Ouch. And there goes the Bulbasaur. Didn't even get my level up. It is my head that is bright. Oh, okay, pal. 
Let there be light on your journey. Let me see how much you trust your Pokemon. Eh, they're alright. I've known them for like almost two hours. They ain't so bad. Sage Troy sent out Abra. It's only Abra. It literally can't do anything. I hope. Astonish. Does it have any real moves? No, it's just gonna use teleport. Level 10, level 10, level 10 hype. Still 25 levels away, but it's a start. 96. Hoot. Let's see now. Pika Squirrel is still the best option for this. Let's go. Hit him with that spark. There he goes. I hope the gym trainers don't all have six Pokemon too, because that wouldn't be very nice. It's only Hopip. Um, I think Leon was close to level 11. Let me try. Close-ish. I don't know if I'd reach... Hopip's definitely not going to give me a level up. Especially with the experience share there. Come on, Leon. Give him the old one, too. Ouch. I hate that a Hopip did more than one hit point to me. I hate that I couldn't... <sighs> Come on, it's Hopip. Take it down. That is a sturdy Hopip. Yes, it is. It must go down. There we go. Olivera to level 11. Nice. Olivera is leveling up. There we go. So is Leon. 1, 1, 1, 1. one. Execute. Alright, perfect. This is what I wanted to use. I can't really use Pluck against it because it can use Reflect. Or maybe it could also use... Maybe it could also use Light Screen. Well, let's hope not. Burn the eggs, cook them. We're having them a meal. Sage Troy. Yes, your trust is real. Of course it is. You think I wouldn't trust a Charmander? What is it, Mom? Hello? Oh, hi, Asprey. How are you? I found a useful item while shopping, so I bought it with your money. But I asked the delivery man to take it to you, so you should stop by the nearest Pokemart or department store and pick it up. I know it'll be useful. Even with my phone on silent, my mother still calls me when I'm playing video games. You showed us what you got, and it is indeed good. Take this elemental stone. However, you should care more about your Pokemon. The way you treat your Pokemon can be too harsh. Remember, Pokemon are not tools of war. Nemesis. Stars! Hmm. He calls himself the Elder, but he was no match for me. Sure enough, those who lecture how you should be nice to Pokemon, they cannot defeat me. All I care about are strong Pokemon that win every time. The rest of them don't mean anything to me. Nemesis used escape rope. This is over here. Oh, finally an encounter. What's up? Oh, it's a rat. It's a rat. It's a... Oh, can't escape. Of course I can't. Why would I escape? Come on, I wanted to escape. You can tell Silver's badass because he can beat a, beat a bell sprout and a hoot hoot. I know, right? Uh, I'm gonna let Pika Squirrel do this. May as well take it down. Spark the rat. Spark the rat. They have a rat problem. I like how the wild rat attack is stronger than some of the, the trainers in here. Finish it. Finish it like Mortal Kombat. Rip his head open. 20. 
Whole lot of nothing. Whole lot of nothing. An escape rope. Well, let's take you down. So good of you to have come. Sprout Tower is a place of training. People and Pokemon test their bonds to build a bright future. I am the final test. Allow me to check the ties between you and your Pokemon. Alright, here we go. It's Elder time. Elder bro. You were challenged by Elderly. Just gonna check something there. Bell Sprout. Can pluck it. It can't stop me. Get it? Elderly? As in the elderly? I, d I did not know that until now. I've never I've never realized that. That's stupid. I don't like that. Take it down. Take it down. Take it down. Take it down. 100. I'm very good 100. Chingling. I don't want to risk you getting taken down. I'm gonna let Leon have some fun. That chingling just opened its mouth real wide. Burn it. Wow. Well, I actually got the burn. That's good. Take it down. I got uproared. My Charmander lost to a Chingling. Can't believe that. Pick a squirrel. Do something. You take it down. Actually lost to a little Chingling. I can't believe that crap. Get out of my way. Barely give it experience either, and he's got the hoot. Send out the hoot. Let's see. Let's see if I can one shot this fella. Close enough. Ooh, decent. Seven, twelve. Nice. Cherubi. Well, I guess now I have to rely on Winona for this. I can't believe I have two starters, and they're both fainted in Bell in Sprout Tower of all things. Shows how good I am at the video game. Uh oh, he's leeching me. I don't like it getting leeched. Ah. Now I'm not going to be able to two-shot him because of this dumb seed. And now we got the beep. Just one more. Don't you use flash. How does a berry flash you? Come on, come on, come on. Oh. There goes my Pokemon. Whole team's getting destroyed here. Hmm, Pika Squirrel's got quick attack. Let's just finish it off. The Cherubi just smiled and it it's the, the light reflected its pearly whites. That's a scary thought of how that Pokemon you just used that move. Anyways, Pika Squirrel leveled up again. That's nice. Actually has I'm sorry. I, I need to see that again. Hmm, the way you battle is quite elegant. You should be able to stand up to Faulkner. Let me offer you a reward. Tell me, what is your favorite evolution of Eevee? Uh... Okay. I guess it's time to decide now, chat. Who am I? Who am I? What do I like? Kind of want Espeon, to be honest. Umbreon. Now I, I, I kind of want Espeon. Oh, yeah. Umbreon. Eevee, Jolteon. Kinda just want Espeon. Gonna go for it. I see, you should take this. Uh, Albaid Orb? Oh, please take this as well. It's a TM contained to move known Flash. We'll let your way in dark caverns. 
I hope you learn and grow from your journey. Uh... Uh-oh. Another encounter. Just what I wanted. Hi, Pidgey. Guess it makes sense for you to be on the top floor here. They added items to make Eevee easier to evolve. Okay. Let me just use the escape rope here. Dim, spear, charge, energy of sunlight, merriment. It causes a certain species of Pokemon to evolve. Quick question, though. Is it mandatory? Because Pokemon, like... I guess Leafeon and Glaceon kind of need this sort of item in this game. But do, uh, do would, would Eevee still naturally evolve from friendship if I did this? Eevee doesn't really learn anything by leveling up. I should probably make it Espeon as soon as possible. Let's do it. Oliveira's looking down steadily. Get confusion faster, yeah. Let's do it. Oliveira's evolving. Eevee's a Pokemon you shouldn't wait for. Fair enough. And yeah, Eevee learns no special moves. What am I thinking? Espeon Sprite looks nice. Your Oliveira evolved into Espeon. Swift F barely counts. Oliveira is dizzy. Well, get used to it. Let's go, cat. I need, to take, I need to take a look at those stats again. Because I when I saw Pachirisu's, I think they were pretty dang high. Whenever you say aloe vera, I hear aloe vera. Car Carlos aloe vera. <laughs> There's a meme right there. Winona's feeling better, so you take, take Winona with you. Hang on a second. Let me check the stats of my Pokemon here. Okay, 13, 16 attack, 15, 17, 37! Special, uh, special attack. Yeah, dang! This, wh why is Pika Squirrel really strong? Actually really strong. Not its regular attack, though. Dang. Buff. I mean, yeah, obviously it evolves, so it's stronger. I'm just saying. That's why Espeon just big com in comparison now. Make a save. Of course, I'm of course I'm gonna overwrite the save file. What else am I gonna do with it? Super buff squirrel. All right, I guess I gotta do the gym. here. I guess I don't really need to keep the experience share on you. I still have this Dunsparce for literally no reason. I'm never going to use it. But I'll put the experience share on Winona now, because Winona's not going to be really useful in there. Um, neither is Lupin, actually. Probably mostly going to sweep with... I'll, I'll use I'll use Oliveira right now. I don't need to box it right now. Probably gonna box it whenever I get the egg. Hang on a second. I just realized. My mom wanted to give me something. Good day, Asper, yeah, isn't it? I have a package for you from your mother. Super potion. Wow! Thanks, Mom. This it probably costs more to have this guy deliver it than the actual potion did. Look at me, I'm high in the sky. I can just walk around them, but I don't know how to do that. I can't believe how ridiculously high up this is, but from here you can tell what it feels like to be a bird Pokemon. Let me see if you're good enough to face Faulkner. Oh boy. Bird Keeper Abe sent out Spiro. Oh boy. Let's see if I can handle this now. Decent enough. I want to see. I want to level this up so I can get confusion. Let's 
67, 67, Pidgey. Send it out. Yes, again. Boppity, boppity, boppity. Bite it. Bite its face off. Oh. I'm getting my flinch luck all used up here, though. Pidgey's got pluck, too. Pluck is better than Peck. Is it better than Wing Attack, though? I don't recall. 64. Do Duo. I wonder if level 13 would give me confusion. Espeon looks so nice. Espeon would make a nice pet. It looks like Espeon looks like it would be really chill and never cause problems as a pet. Now I gotta switch out here. I think it's time. Pika Squirrel, get in there. Time to spark. Same base power as Wing Attack? Alright. I don't like the way one of those heads leans in at me. Looks like it's accusing me of something. Trying to catch me doing something bad. Kick down. Super effective. 55. 112. Big Squirrel. Bird Keeper Abe defeated. This can't be true! But it in fact is. Friend. Ho oh, ho, you some kind of big shot? We'll see what happens when you get pushed around up here. Think you'll stagger and fall? People here are training night and day to become bird Pokemon masters. Bring it on. That is kind of messed up. He's like, oh, what's the matter, kid? You afraid you'll fall to your death? That's kind of messed up. Actually kind of messed up. Bite him. Is he planning on murdering me? I wouldn't surprise me. are on his hands. Too many. He can't be trusted as a gym trainer. Come on. Oh, <laughs> come on. Level 13. Hi. 13. Sixty-nine. Not enough. Zubat. I know this is the fly technically a flying type gym. But it was also more so the bird type gym, huh? Somebody was desperate for variety. Oh boy, did nothing. All right, time to switch. Confusion would be pretty helpful about now. Send out the Pika Squirrel, which is apparently my strongest option. Astonish. Spark him. I gotta fix my seat again here. One shot. 31. 60. Okay. Winona's leveling up. That's fine. At zero two attack. Winona's not going to be able to do a whole lot going forward, unfortunately. Not until I get Altaria, but it'll probably be worth it. And then I get hit by an ice type move, and then I'm going to, like, what was the point? Super effective. Fainted. 85, 85. Wingu. Now, this is definitely something I can just spark through, no problem. Great. Now we're gonna see what Faulkner's got for me. Watch Faulkner have some ridiculous shenanigans. You just know he will. Birdkeeper Rod. Gah! Can't kill me now. Fucker skills are for real. Don't get cocky. Can't really use my Chikorita yet. Let's see. Don't... You know what? I'm just gonna waste a potion on that. Just because... Let's see now. This should be fine. Let's just go for it. I don't need to worry about... Friendship anymore. I, Faulkner, the Le Violet City Gym Leader. People say you can clip flying Pokemon types, yeah, flying type wings with a jolt of electricity. I can't read today. 
I won't allow such insults to bird Pokemon. I'll show you the real power of the magnificent bird Pokemon. Here we go. What's he got? Leader Faulkner's got a whole set. Do duo. He's leading with the big stuff. Okay. Not a not to, so I don't need bite. I'm just gonna send in Kick Squirrel right away. Because he's probably gonna hit me with a flying type attack and I can resist. Oh, he's going growl, huh? I'll be switching after anyway. Should be more than enough. I'll quick attack. Go ahead. Go ahead, weenie. You do. Super effective. Knock him out. Easy. Even with the growl, the Doduo goes down easy. 61. Okay, level 13, confusion. There we go. Perfect. Just the right level for it. Now, just gonna get rid of Tail Whip. Don't really need that no more. Now, if he has Zubat, I can have an I have an option for that now. Pika Squirrel. Let's see, Pidgeotto. Hmm. I don't. I have a Growl on me right now, so you know what? I'm gonna send in Leon. I don't expect him to live, but I gotta reset anyway. See if I can hit him with a burn. Unlikely. Here we go. Just like I thought. No burn. Yeah, just tackle. Uh, what was I about to do? Right. This is no doubt his ace at level 15, so just hit him with the spark. Alright, one more. Alright, he's paralyzed. Oh, he's... Okay, he's got a berry. Put him in the super potion range now. Oh, so close. Hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. Okay, good, good, good. Down 181. Your Faulkner is about to send out Shatot. Send it out, I guess. There's still four Pokemon left. And my Pika Squirrel is already about to go down. I got the Crucial paralyzed. Come on. Oh, not sweet. Oh. Pika Squirrel MVP. This squirrel is having no crap today. We don't agree that. Level 12. Peak squirrel leveled up. It deserves it. Let's see. Swablu. I I know that thing's gonna knock yeah, gonna go down easy. Keep sweeping. Doesn't matter, I got a crit. Let's see. And watch the last one be Farfetch'd, okay. I was about to say, oh no, he still has another one after this. I guarantee you he has Gligar, and I'm not gonna be able to spark it. Just watch. Oh, Pika Squirrel is sweeping. Pika Squirrel is sweeping. Murkrow, wow. <laughs> I thought he was going to have an option. The wind is finally with us. I guess they wanted to stick to the theme of birds, I guess, but... He could, they could have gotten away with giving him a haunch crow here because of stone, but... Took, see that witch? That witch had a broom and the, and the squirrel took it and swept. 
I just, I understand. Help out gracefully. That's right, you will. You lose. You're a loser. You lose. Oh boy. For pity's sake, my dad's Jer cherished bird Pokemon. But a defeat is a defeat. All right. Take this official G uh, Pokemon League badge. This one's the Zephyr badge. Yay! I might still need this squirrel for a Scyther. Pokemon include a trip. Level 20 will obey you. It also enables you to use Hidden Move Rock Smash anytime. Attain 51! Oh boy. Let's see. I think before you act, TM can use only once. Contains Roost. There are gyms and cities, towns ahead. Make good use of them. As for your next move, I would suggest Azalea Town. Alright, I did it. I beat the first gym. I got a full MVP team here now. The squirrel's super OP, and guess who's calling? Hello, we've discovered something. The details are well, I can't really say anything. We want you to carry that egg. My assistant is at the Pokemark. Can you go meet him and pick up that egg? All right, then. I guess I'm gonna deposit... I'm gonna go ahead and deposit uh, Dunsparce and then take the egg. Someone's PC. Deposit... We don't need this thing. We never will need it. I've got good Pokemon now. The XP share will help the fraction. Oh, uh, wait, what? Where's the lab assistance? Not you. Uh. He's in the gate. Isn't he normally in the Pokemon Center? That's the original when you try and leave, isn't it? No, gate- uh, sorry, you meant gate is in the entrance area. Let me go there. Again, I haven't played this in eternity. No, it's not there. He's in the mart? He just told me a second ago and I didn't read it. I was just thinking it would be exactly the same as before. There he is. Long time no see. I've been waiting for you. This is Professor Elm. Thing is, we would like to take care of the egg. Yeah, sure. Let's see. After you left, Professor Elm received a phone call. I have no idea what they were talking about, but after a while, Professor Elm suddenly cried out, I can't think of anyone more suited than Asprey. Then he insisted I hand this egg to you. That's how I came here to deliver this egg. It seems the Pokemon will hatch only if it... Yeah, from it. Only when you keep it in your party of Pokemon. That's another reason we chose in you. The original game, they just put him in the Pokemon Center. That's immediately why I went there. Mm. Hello? Oh my, that egg must be... I see, so it was handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Elm, then Professor Elm to you. Now I get it! That egg is truly an important egg. Please do take care of it for me. Is that understood? I'm counting on you. Yeah, get out of here. Get out of here. You again. Asprey, I must say, I rather enjoyed our battle. I'd like to give you my phone number. It might be useful in the future. Okay. This definitely doesn't happen in the game, right? See you around and good luck. That's that's something that this, this hack only does, I'm assuming. Hmm. Anyways, with that... Did I heal? even heal? No, I did not. Well, time to go back and heal, then. Have they added the Faulkner encounter? All right. So I got Faulkner's phone number. Nice. Get out of there. Pop, 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 pop. Excellent. Everything's happy. Everything's wholesome. Let's see. What other Pokemon? Let me just pop my head up ahead. See if there's anything else I can catch. I just realized there was like a bug catcher back here that I didn't even bother to battle. Or check to see what Pokemon can be caught around this spot. Let me go back here. Come along, little Charmander. Another Battlesprout! Who saw that coming? I can't leave this bug catcher undefeated. I may as well get the experience from him, even though it's not going to be worth anything. 
super effective. 36. Winona still gain. Right, experience share still in Winona. I caught a bunch of Pokemon. Let me battle with you. He needs to go down. He needs to learn his place in the world on the first route. Bug catcher Wade. Just a little level up fodder for my little friend. Gonna need... Hopefully there's gonna be Wooper on the, ne on the next route so I can use Razor Leaf on something. 12. No special attack boost. Surskit. This thing is part water type. It becomes part flying type instead when it evolves, but still. Can just ember it. Whoop whoop. Burn him alive. Burn him alive! Forty-six. Forty-six. Lady Ba. This fool's bringing a Lady Ba. Nobody uses Lady Ba. Not even. Thought I just saw something on the ground there. Was hoping there wasn't just like a mouse on the floor that scurried by. No. I hope not. I hate. I hate the sight of those little things. They. Oh, just gives me a. Shivers. Another massive spider? No. I don't see. I haven't seen a massive spider since that one time. Got a short sure thing. Take it down. Ratata heard me talking crap. Leon gained 48. There we go. That's actually a decent amount of experience from this guy. Aw, oh, man. You're awesome. I like you. I look for Pokemon every day. When I'm in tall grass, funnel kinds of berries. If you like, I'll share some. Sure, man. I'll, t I'll take your number, and uh, then I'll never talk to you. You hear from me as soon as I find anything you might like. A Pokeball. Well, I could use this. Let's get out of here. Let's see what else I can find in the grass here. Oh, Abra. Well, that's fine. I don't need to catch that. I have Espeon now. And it has teleport. Duh, why did I even try to attack it? Uh, the worst, my worst instance with a mouse. Now, actually, I have two bad instances with a mouse. There was a time I, I found one in my package of bread I laid on the counter. Ever since that happened, I've been keeping bread in my fridge. Never again will I keep bread on the counter after that. And then there was the time one died in my, uh, in the heater. And the smell ended up getting so bad, and eventually I found had to find what that was, and then take it out. Oh, those were both really bad, bad times. There's Cascoon. Ever since that happened, let me tell you, I hate, I hate the little things. I can't stand them. Whenever I, whenever I like get out of here and settle in a new place, first thing I'm doing, making sure those things do not bug me because I hate them. I do not like them. Chat, I think I should get a cat once I get it once I uh, get that house. For those that don't know, since we have a lot of new people here today, I was uh saving up for a house. Planned to start looking this summer, but that's not going to happen given the state of the world and the way the housing market is apparently all going. Saved up for years and now I'm probably going to have to put it off for like another year. <laughs> Ugh. Once I get settled into that place, I'm probably buy I'm probably getting a cat. The cat can deal with that for me. No, no, people are desperate to sell. I guess that's true. But I was supposed to sort out I was supposed to sort some things out once tax season was over, but tax season has kind of been, you know, delayed, so I'm I'm, I'm more so just worried about getting out of this current apartment in the summer, but I'll, everything's on hold. Anyways, wait up, what's the hurry? You have some good Pokemon there. It must be from training you gave them around Violet City. The training at the gym must have been especially helpful. As a souvenir, take this. Increase the power of grass type moves. I can just give this to Chikorita. Cats like to bring you the dead mice, though. Okay, I will not get a cat, then. Oh, 
when you get a cat, get it to say hi to the stream chat. Let's see. My mom is not good with mice either. Oops. I remember one time when I lived at my when I was still living at my mom's place, I went out for a walk. And my mom called me when I was out in the middle of my walk to come home because I guess a mouse had just like went out into the kitchen floor and just died. I don't know, it just decided to die in the middle of the kitchen floor and she's like, "I'm not touching that. You come home right now and pick, take that thing outside." She did not want to go near it. Oh, Mareep. But I already have a Pika Squirrel. Burn the sheep. Get to level 13. Should let little, uh, little Lupin up front. Oh, that did not do a lot. I don't want to replace the squirrel. You know what? I'm going to use Confusion on it instead. Let me do that. Pika Squirrel doesn't evolve. Maybe it doesn't need to change. I don't want Ampharos for this playthrough, though. Fury attack. Fury attack! No! Yes, I will give up on Fury attack. This is bad. Oh, hello, a double battle. I bet you wish you had helping hand now, mister. Roar. People run when I roar, but you came looking. That pleases me. Now take this. I don't like this guy. Maybe I should back away from him. Let's see. Roar, it's roar. Even Pokemon run from a good roar. I can sell it in this game. All right, let's see. Who should I? Razor Leaf probably go up front. Uh, yeah, these two up front would be nice. Let's do that. I haven't seen you around, so you think you're pretty tough? I found some good Pokemon in the grass. I think they'll do it for me. Maniac, Rune Maniac, Shantru, Shantru. Can Razor Leaf this? Let's hope things go well. I'm a little worried. Hmm. Let's see how this goes. Hopefully, I survive a turn. I want Chikorita to eventually evolve. Oh boy, did not do a whole lot. Critical hit on that, that's good. Uh oh, Poison Sting. That could ruin everything! I feel insulted that Poison Sting did that much damage, though. Just keep doing this, get rid of them. Finish them off. Ugh. Don't poison me, please. Oh, I did not need a Thunder Wave right now. Definitely did not need a Thunder Wave. Okay, let's Ember the Sand True now. Razor Leaf this. Oh, boy. Don't, don't crit me. Oh, boy. I'm gonna have to switch out, Lupin. No! Please, I wanted experience. Okay, there goes one. We drop two. We drop two. Let's go for the daily double. 43. That's right, you leveled up. Good job. Metal Claw. Alright, I have to get that, but now is not the best time. I'll just get rid of a Growl. Why not? Doesn't matter. Metal Claw. Lupin 43, Winona gained 88, Leon gained 69, Lupin gained 69. Nice, level 11. That's a decent little chunk of change. There's no target. Lupin is hurt by poison. And the level up, did you. No, Drifloon. Alright, so I gotta get. I have to get Lupin out of there. And. Aw, oh, come on. 
My grass type's gotta go after that. Well, at least I got Metal Claw, but... I don't exactly want to use that on you. Just send in... Let's see. Pika Squirrel can't hurt the Onyx, but the Drift Loon. I'm just gonna send in Olivera. Come on. Let's take it down. Gust. There is nothing le less threatening than Drift Loon using Gust. Even though it's a stab move, it's so... Oh, gosh. Well, goodbye, Leon. Leon! Help! Now we have to rely on Pika Squirrel. I'm gonna need to run back and heal. Let's see, Spark the Drift Loon. Confusion the Onyx. You don't have any special defense, Onyx. You never will. Okay. Close enough. Ouch. Hmm, I don't really have any revives. Um, I can walk around some of the trainers, can't I? I don't... Well, I don't know the layout of this game. It's probably gonna be... It's probably gonna be mixed up a bit more as I go on. Let's see. Pika Squirrel was hurt by Aftermath. Oh, boohoo. 63. Winona gained a lot. Confusion. 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 Free level up? No. Lady Joan, Ruin Maniac, Gordon. You are strong! Shucks, I thought I could win! Okay. I'm gonna run back. I'm at the start. I'm at the start of the route, so this should be fine. I got a couple of fainted Pokemon and status conditions. Ugh. Oh boy. Another encounter. What do we got? Magnemite. That's fine, I guess. How do you get Magnezone in this game? I just now realized that. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Finish off loop and see if I care. I just now realized in HeartGold Soul Silver, if you couldn't get Leafeon and Glaceon, you couldn't get you couldn't get Magnezone, Nose Pass, or uh uh Dang, who else? Who the hell else was there? I'm assuming there's items, just like for uh, the, just like there was for all the evolutions a second ago. Probo pass. Didn't I just? Did I say probo pass? I said nose pass, didn't I? Leon's feeling better. Come on out, Leon. Stashio boy. Alright, can just pop a bit forward down. Route 32. What's up, Leon? You feeling okay? Leon is blankly staring in this direction. Wanna call its name? Yeah, sure. Your Pokemon seems so happy. Hooray. Isn't that nice? Who's a happy boy? Burn it. Burn it to the ground. Burn it all down. Or not, because it's using th synthesis. I hate that move. So much for the quick experience. Just get out of here. Run for it. <laughs> Run for it. Oh, hi, Yo-Yo. Did you just get here? Hang on. Put the trainer up there. What about that? Yeah. Item. Bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. We don't need electric sheep. Don't think I can really grind off the sheep easily that either. A repel! Excellent. Oh, look who it is! A friend we don't need.
This ain't gonna be getting me to level 14, but it's gonna give me give me something. And Swablu something. Swablu will get there. I might, I might end up just putting Swablu in the daycare or something by the time I get up there. See how it goes. Uh-huh, yeah, and you know. Pardon Pokemon Battle? I'm on the phone. Oh, alright, I'll accept your challenge. Pictigur Liz. She got the Nidoran. I don't have a ground type option, but I do have confusion for this. Experience is really getting divided up, but it's gonna pay off in the long run. Just watch. I said I was gonna mix and match the team, but now I'm, I'm already feel like I'm dead set on a couple Pokemon never leaving the team. Shows what I know, chat. Like, I don't, I, I don't want to get rid of this Espeon. I like this Espeon, in fact. I mean, I can see myself possibly getting rid of Chikorita, eventually. Ponyta. I don't have an option for fire types right now, do I? Just confuse it. Just hit confusion. Just smash the confusion button and watch the Ponyta go bye-bye. It's a horse. You can't fight. It's a horse. Unless I find something much better. Like, uh... I don't feel like going back for Houndour and Shanks, honestly. I'm going to level 14. I'm going to level 228. 228 experience points. Before I could get serious, I lost. Yeah, that's right. Blame it all on someone else. Oh, you're a big journey to see the sights? Let's be friends. Can I have your phone number? Want to hear about everything you've seen? Sure! Everybody can have my number. Why not? I'll telephone you if you hear anything interesting. Of course you can. Let's see. Antidote. Is that... Oh, Mina, you can't have my number. Not everybody gets my number now. What is that supposed to be? Oh, that's for the magnet train, right? Can I easily go around here? Okay. Should be fine. Ah! Okay, I almost just ran into him. I don't want to deal with the six Magikar, fella. Actually, that'd probably be good for, um... For, uh, Chikorita. How would you like to have this tasty, nutritious Slowpoke tail? For you right now, it's just a million dollars! No. You don't want it? Then scram, shoo. Yahoo, it's Friday. I'm Frida Friday. Nice to meet you. Here's a poison barb. Too bad I don't have any poison type moves. Way to date the episode, Frida. Oh, it's wicked. You'll be shocked how good it makes poison type moves. Spoiler alert. Poison type moves still suck. This area is great for fishing. You can see loads of water-type Pokemon. Do you like water-type Pokemon? Yeah! Fantastic. You should take this TM. TM3! Water Pulse. It pairs well with any water-type Pokemon. Huh. Who can learn this, actually? Boot it up, TM! No one can learn it. Should I make my Pokemon hold? Maybe an item that increases attack power. Maybe. Bonjour. How are you? Are you picking Apricorn? Sure. Way to go, little Apricorn collector. I feel so great. I want to give you this. Obtain Lure Balls. All right, then. Lure Ball. This makes it easy to catch Pokemon that appear when you go fishing. Actually, this is made from Apricorns. Consider those two small gifts from me. If you want more, go to Azalea Town. A man named Kirk can make special Pokeballs out of Apricorns. Apricorns rule! This guy really likes his Apricorns. There's still a bunch of trainers I need to beat up around here, though. I wonder if I can find anything else in the water around here.
thing. Thing. Tentacool. I don't need that. But I can just confusion it, I guess. Nobody ever needs tentacle because it's tenta lame. It's never cool. It never will be. In a second. I'm just gonna let Lupin deal with all of this stuff here. I'm really good at fishing, but even I'm even better at Pokemon. Still ended up going quite a bit, didn't I? Let me just fix my seat. Gul'dean. When a push comes to shove, I can always switch into Pika Squirrel. Razor Leaf it. Oh, Super Sonic. Making my day happy. Hopefully a critical hit happens. Isn't Super Sonic's accuracy still like 55 or 60 in this game? Which for the opponent means always hits. 55%. Ah, yes. Just like Sing. Come on, Lupin. I don't know if we're, I doubt we're gonna get to Bayleaf today, but... You're gonna grow. You're gonna grow, you little fella. 1-1-1. One, one, one. Synthesis. You know what? Sure. I'll let you have this little friend. We don't need Growl. We don't need Growl at all. Then again, wait, no. Is it still like... Gen uh, aren't all AI hard-coded to have a 50-50 for all stat moves? I know it worked that way in the Game Boy games for sure. I cannot. Razor Leaf Quillfish. So, pick a squirrel. Actually... I can confusion that. Let's do that. Take advantage. Is it Lupin because playing Persona 5 or Code Realize? Uh, both. I think that's only in the Game Boy games, the 50 50 thing. Hard in time. Might be only Gen 1 and 2. Yeah, in the Game Boy games, um, the AI does not play by the same rules you do. At all. Kinda ridiculous. 14. Look at that, plus 3 to special attack. Fisherman Ralph, you've been taken down. 448. Don't young people fish anymore. I can teach you how to fish well if you like to exchange phone numbers. Alright, Ralph. Give me your phone number. That's great. I'm happy to have made a younger friend. Uh, my Pokemon freshly caught. Is this the Magikarp guy? Or in this case, is he going to be the sixth Gyarados guy? I hope not. No nope, Poliwag. Let's go. Come on. Oh. Hey. Poliwag hitting that 55% again. Here's a lesson in probability. In Pokemon, it's always against you. Let's go. Just smash the button. Go, little loop, and go. Wake up, this isn't according to plan. Come on, come on. It's 60%? Okay. It's weird. Hypnosis was, like, buffed very slightly in Platinum and Heart Gold Soul Silver, wasn't it? I think it was, like, it, it was, like, 55 or 50 accuracy in those games, but for some reason they changed it to 60 in Platinum. It's weird. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Take it down, take it down, take it down. Water Gun, that's right. If the, if the buff is present, it's... If the buff is present, it's 70. It's definitely 60. Okay, we're all... Nobody seems to know the right answer. 
Everybody's right, but they're not. There we go. There we go. Fisherman Henry send out Remo Raid. Just Remo Raid. I'm absolutely positive. Well, now that you've typed that, you're definitely you're definitely right. Absolutely. How could you be wrong? This is where we go. In circles. Went on to game 117. Here comes Goldine. At least I'm getting a nice little boost here. Razor leaf him. Welcome to stream chat, where there's several different answers, and I get yelled at for not following all of them. <laughs> oh. I should just use a synthesis here. I kind of forgot I just learned that. There we go. Gain your health, Lupin. Gain your health. And rip the fish apart. And now I'm confused again. Absolutely confused. And now you're gonna... Okay, good, good, good. I didn't want you to get hurt yourself. Confusion there, friend. Taken down. When was the last time Winona evolved? Or, yeah, leveled up. Terminology, not here today. Poison barbs there. I have the Miracle Seed on. I just remembered. I totally forgot to put that on at the start of the route. Whoa, you made me lose that fish. All right, let's maybe take this guy out and call it. Then we'll take a break and move on to Mystery Dungeon. Good old Magikarp. Razor leaf him. Razor leaf out of existence. Hey, excuse me. What? This magic carp just used reversal on me. Oh boy. Oh boy, I know where this is going. Oh, no, it used bubble now, too. What, what, what is this trend? This is, no, this, you don't understand. I'm supposed to just mash the A button and win this fight. That's not how this works. That's not how this works at all. 31. Feebass. Well, that's, I guess that's fitting for this fella. That Magikarp's not real at all. It's a lie. And this thing's just hideous. And this thing, it's actually splashing, though. That's weird. Here you go. Come on, so close to 14. Uh, wait a second, though. Only Cyndaquil evolves at 14. I need to level 16. We ain't getting that today. And rip them apart. Just one shot. It's magic car. What could go wrong? Perfect. Should be able to earn some more experience with Lupin in the cave. Wow, Lupin got nothing out of or Winona got nothing out of that. 320. Nice. Okay. It's nearly. Eh, nearly three hours on this. I'd say this is a good point to call the first episode. I've just about had my fill for the time being. Oof. So for the YouTube audience, this is going to be where it ends for you. We're going to be moving on to Mystery Dungeon next for the stream. I'm just going to take a little BRB, eat a snack, use the washroom, and, uh, but anyways, for YouTube, hope you all enjoy, hope you all enjoying this so far. It was fun to start. I'd like to keep going. 
and uh, have a good night. Bye-bye.